Tim Southy picks up 6 wickets and Roddy Burns gets his third test done. As the third day of the test match has been washed out because of rain, players had an extended session in the fourth day. The morning session clearly went in New Zealand's favour. It was Tim Southey who picked up a bunch of wickets, Rory Burns at the other end showed great skills and completed his century with the help of the tailenders. At the end of the England innings, they were bowled out for 275 runs, lagging 103 runs from the New Zealand score. Tim Southey picked up 6 wickets and Rory Burns brought up his third test century, first in last two years. New Zealand started their second innings with a lead of 103 runs and lost Devon Conway and Ken Williamson early. Conway scored 23 runs and he has scored the most runs in a test match on debut as an opener, 200 in the first innings and 23 in the second innings. As only 100 overs remaining in the final day, New Zealand will look to score some quick runs and get England bowled out. And another fact in this test match. While combining all the players in both these teams, Rory Burns is the only batsman who have not hit a single six in his test career. And England have never lost a test match at Lords since 2014, where India beat them by 78 runs.